he raced a funny car. It was the first car to break the 200 mile per hour barrier in New Zealand, reaching 203 miles an hour, leaving the quarter mile behind in just seven seconds. He raced top fuel dragsters and held the New Zealand quarter mile record for over 20 years. The last one covered the quarter mile in just 5.5 seconds and reached a staggering 263 miles an hour. In the early 90s, he was appointed as the New Zealand representative to the FIA, the World Motorsport Governing Body, a position he held for five years. He built up a specialist automotive parts company from scratch and introduced New Zealand racing enthusiasts to leading American brands. He sold that company to focus on building up an aero restoration company that continues to restore some of the world's most iconic aircraft. He spent three years restoring a Curtis P-40 Kitty Hawk, an American single-seat fighter aircraft used during World War II, and then, at the age of 53, learned how to fly it, and flew it at air shows like Warbirds over Wanaka, firing the real guns fitted. He modified a 1934 Flathead Ford that, when new, had a top speed of 80 miles an hour and took it to 193 miles an hour on the Bonneville Salt Flats. That's a record that has stood for 10 years. He was involved in establishing New Zealand's premier classic car museum, Warbirds and Wheels in Wanaka, where he now lives. His father kept a Packard Rolls-Royce Merlin Mustang engine in his workshop and fired it up every year just for fun. He is Garth Hogan, and this is his story, his quest for speed he shared with his father.